The incident shook the country, including President Til Sisi. His first field visit in office was to the harassment victim. He told her he takes full responsibility. We are sorry. We are not good people. Don't be sad. You are the most dear to us. Egypt won't progress without women. I won't talk to the interior minister. I will talk to every soldier in Egypt, whether it be army or police. This must never happen or continue here in Egypt. For years, authorities took sexual harassment cases lightly, driving women away from police stations to file complaints and encouraging assaulters to keep on. But not anymore. This man told me you're a babe, we will do what we want with you. I stared at him and he laughed. They want to intimidate us. This man and two more were immediately arrested for verbally harassing women on the street. They and dozens more were organizing a rally against such incidents that are becoming common in Egypt. Earlier, a new decree law was issued by former interim president Adli Mansour that criminalizes any verbal or physical act that has sexual references. But they say it's not enough. It's important to make a stand continuously, not only today, to continue to activate because this is an issue that has to be dealt with from the roots, from the starting with the education system and then going up to the legal system. Uh, now we have a new law. It could be better, but it's a good start. Numerous reports on Egypt confirm that over 90% of women have experienced a type of sexual harassment. <laughs> And these women here are calling for their rights to walk in the streets unharmed. I usually get verbally harassed when I'm walking, but I've never been physically harassed. But I know a lot of women who have been physically harassed before. It's very, it's very humiliating, it's very annoying, and I think it's, it's, it makes me feel like I'm not respected, like I'm not treated as a person or a human being in my own country. Sexual harassment is a problem that Egypt has been long suffering from. But the Tahrir incident has encouraged these dozens to come here and say stop. They cannot take it anymore. Adel Mahroui, CCTV, Cairo.